and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in, in which we partake of Christ, His sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with His grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you, you gave, gave us the Eucharist as the, as the memorial of your suffering and death. death. May, May our, our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit. God, forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh. And dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we beseech you, O Lord, your grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ your Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Five Glorious Mystery The First Glorious Mystery, The Resurrection our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second glorious mystery, the Ascension. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, 
Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth glorious mystery, the Assumption of Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O, o Holy, Holy Mother of God. God. Despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever-glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us. That we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, Grant we beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your Church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life. 
whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, Advocate and Guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you, that our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share with all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today is Wednesday, Solemnity of Saints Peter and Paul, Apostles. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church, integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the Rock who saves us. Let us approach Him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. The Lord is God, the mighty God the great king over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker, for he is our God and we are his people, the flock his shepherds. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massah, they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Forty years I entered that generation. I said, they are a people whose hearts go astray and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship the Lord, the King of Apostles. Please be seated. I know the one whom I have trusted, and I am certain that he, the just judge, has power to keep safe what he has entrusted to me until that day. O God, you are my God, for you I long. For you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you, like a dry weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary to see your strength and your glory. For your love is better than life, my lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name I will lift up my hands. My soul shall be filled as with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed I remember you. On you I muse through the night. For you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you. 
your right hand hold me fast. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. God's grace in me has not been without fruit. It is always at work in me. Bless the Lord, all your works of the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Angels of the Lord, bless the Lord. You heavens, bless the Lord. All you waters above the heavens, bless the Lord. All you hosts of the Lord, bless the Lord. Sun and moon, bless the Lord. Stars of heaven, bless the Lord. Every shower and dew, bless the Lord. All you winds, bless the Lord. Fire and heat, bless the Lord. Cold and chill, bless the Lord. Dew and rain, bless the Lord. Frost and chill, bless the Lord. Ice and snow, bless the Lord. Nights and days, bless the Lord. Light and darkness, bless the Lord. Lightnings and clouds, bless the Lord. Let the earth bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Mountains and hills, bless the Lord. Everything growing from the earth, bless the Lord. You springs, bless the Lord. Seas and rivers, bless the Lord. You dolphins and all water creatures, bless the Lord. All you birds of the air, bless the Lord. All you beasts, wild and tame, bless the Lord. You sons of men, bless the Lord. O Israel, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Priests of the Lord, bless the Lord. Servants of the Lord, bless the Lord. Spirits and souls of the just, bless the Lord. Holy men of humble heart, bless the Lord. Hananiah, Azariah, Mishael, bless the Lord. Praise and exalt Him above all forever. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Let us praise and exalt Him above all forever. Blessed are You, Lord, in the firmament of heaven. Praiseworthy and glorious and exalted above all forever. I have fought the good fight. I have run the race to the finish. I have kept the faith. Sing a new song to the Lord, His praise in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its Maker. Let Zion's sons exult in their King. Let them praise His name with dancing, and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in His people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory. Shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips and a two-edged sword in their hand to deal out vengeance to the nations and punishment on all the peoples, to bind their kings in chains and their nobles in fetters of iron, to carry out the sentence preordained. This honor is for all his faithful. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace to people of goodwill. We praise we you, we bless you, you, we adore you, we glorify you, you, we give you thanks for your great glory. Lord God, heavenly King, O God Almighty Father, Lord Jesus Christ's only begotten Son, Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. You take away the sins of the world, receive our prayer. You are seated at the right hand of the Father, have mercy on us. For you alone are the Holy One, you alone are the Lord, you alone are the Most High, Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit, in the glory of God the Father. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who on the solemnity of the Apostles Peter and Paul, give us the noble and holy joy of this day, grant we pray that your Church may in all things follow the teaching of those through whom she received the beginnings of right religion. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. 
In those days, King Herod laid hands upon some members of the church to harm them. He had James, the brother of John, killed by the sword. And when he saw that this was pleasing to the Jews, he proceeded to arrest Peter also. It was the feast of unleavened bread. He had him taken into custody and put in prison, and at the guard of four squads of four soldiers each. He intended to bring him before the people after Passover. Peter thus was being kept in prison, but prayer by the church was fervently being made to God on his behalf. On the very night before Herod was to bring him to trial, Peter, secured by double chains, was sleeping between two soldiers, while outside the door guards kept watch on the prison. Suddenly, the angel of the Lord stood by him, and a light shone in the cell. He tapped Peter on the side and awakened him, saying, Get up quickly. The chains fell from his wrists. The angel said to him, Put on your belt and your sandals. He did so. Then he said to him, Put on your cloak and follow me. So he followed him out, not realizing that what was happening through the angel was real. He thought he was seeing a vision. They passed the first guard, then the second, and came to the iron gate leading out to the city, which opened for them by itself. They emerged and made their way down an alley, and suddenly the angel left him left him. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The angel of the Lord will rescue those who fear him. The angel of the Lord will rescue those who fear him. I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall be ever in my mouth. Let my soul glory in the Lord. The lowly will hear me and be glad. The angel of the Lord will rescue those who fear him. Glorify the Lord with me. Let us together extol his name. I sought the Lord, and he answered me, and delivered me from all my fears. The angel of the Lord will rescue those who fear him. Look to him that you may be radiant with joy, and your faces may not blush with shame. When the poor one called out, the Lord heard, and from all his distress he saved him. The angel of the Lord will rescue those who fear him. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him and delivers them. Taste and see how good the Lord is. Blessed the man who takes refuge in him. The angel of the Lord will rescue those who fear him. A reading from the second letter of St. Paul to Timothy. I, Paul, am ready, already being poured out like a libation and the time of my departure is at hand. I have completed well. I have finished the race. I have kept the faith. From now on, the crown of righteousness awaits me, which the Lord, the just judge, will award me on that day, and not only to me, but to all who have longed for his appearance. The Lord stood by me and gave me strength, so that through me, the proclamation may be completed, and all the Gentiles might hear it. And I was rescued from the lion's mouth. The Lord will rescue me from every evil threat, and will bring me safe to his heavenly kingdom. To him be glory forever and ever. Amen. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Please stand. are Peter, and upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of the netherworld shall not prevail against it.
The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. When Jesus went into the region of Caesarea Philippi, he asked his disciples, Who do people say that the Son of Man is? They replied, Some say John the Baptist, others Elijah, still others Jeremiah, or one of the prophets. He said to them, But who do you say that I am? Simon Peter said in reply, You are the Christ, the Son of the living God. Jesus said to him in reply, Blessed are you, Simon, son of Jonah, for flesh and blood has not revealed these to you, but to my heavenly Father. And so I say to you, you are Peter, and upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of the netherworld shall not prevail against it. I will give you the keys to the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. Whatever you lose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat and welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary. Our life is a journey and a journey to holiness. Tayo ay, ang, bahay, ang buhay natin ay isang lakbay, paglalakbay, patungo sa kabanalan, patungo sa langit, basically. So our life is meant to end where God is. Because that, that is where our life started. And God, who, who is um, uh, the end of our lives, is also the beginning. The beginning of everything. Sa Diyos lahat nagsimula. Sa Diyos na siyang pag-ibig. God who is infinite love. That is where all it, start, it all started. That is where our life started. That is where our journey began. That God is a God of infinite love. That God is love. And because God is love, God is infinite love, He had to, he had to share that love with others. Kaya nga tayo nilalang. Kaya tayo can create. We were created out of God's need to share His love for others. Because love needs to be shared. Hindi yan tinatago. Love is not kept to oneself, needs to be shared. And so God needed someone to share it, and that's why God created human beings. Ginawa tayo para may bahagi yung kanyang infinite, infinite love. Kaso, tayo naman na ginawa out of His love and to be shared ng love of God, we um, became stubborn. We were stubborn, as we see in the story of Adam and Eve. We were stubborn and we wanted, we wanted to be like God. We want, to be, we want to change places with God. And so we disobeyed. In the story of human, humanity, we disobeyed. We ruined the original plan of God. And so God had to do damage control. And what God did para mabalik yung original plan niya was to send His only begotten Son to remind us that God is love, and that, God, that God continues to love us. Kahit na tayo nagkamali, kahit na tayo nagdisobey in Adam and Eve and even in our own personal lives, God continues to love us. And so God sent His only Son. His only Son, who gave His life for our, for our sake, for our forgiveness, and so that we can continue with our journey. So, laging ganun yung story natin, that God is love, we were created out of love, we sinned, we disobeyed, we, were, we failed, 
But then God continues to save us. God continues to recreate us. God continues to try and bring us back to heaven, to bring us back to holiness. So it all started with the love of God. Ganun din kay St. Peter and Paul, whose solemnity we celebrate today. St. Peter and Paul did, uh, you know, started with, with Jesus, uh, but, but they failed. They failed. St. Peter denied Jesus. St. Paul persecuted the beginning, the beginning church, the church that was forming. So they failed. They also sinned. They also uh, needed God's love. They failed in their, in, their, um, in their love for God. And God, again, came to the rescue. So, magip ulit. Budumating ulit ang Diyos para i-rescue sila. Um, St. Peter was able to redeem himself by becoming the you know, first pope. And St. Paul, as we know, became a very good, very energetic apostle and preacher to the world. No? They, na, because of God's grace, because of God's forgiveness, they were able to get back on the journey, get back into the mission, and fulfill their mission. And I think this is our, in ng ayong ating journey, na, despite the fact that God has been very loving to us, that God has been very generous to us, we continue to fail. And most of the time, yung failure natin, that failure, our failure, is a failure of wanting to be like God, wanting to exchange places with God. Diba? Madalas yung ating failure, yung ating mga kasalanan, is that we want to do things on our own. Gawin natin kung ano yung gusto natin. We like spoiled brats, no? Gusto natin, gagawin natin kung ano yung gusto natin. Gagawin natin kung ano yung uh, gusto natin gawin. Not caring about the plan of God, what God wants us to do. But um, God continues to, to wait. And sometimes God continues to uh, you know, touch us so that we can, back, we can get back on track. No? Para bumalik tayo so, dun sa dapat nating path, no? dapat nating way, that is to go back to the love of God. So therefore, our, our journey, which began with God, should end with God. And therefore, our journey is a journey from humility, the humility of, of sin and failure. But it's a journey of, that starts from humility towards holiness. And the holiness being not, you know, not just uh, uh, kneeling and praying, but the holiness is in uh, trying to be humble and trying to, to share with others the love that we have received from God, acknowledging God as the source of our love and sharing that love with others. Kaya nga doon sa, sa gospel na binasa natin, when, G, when uh, Peter was asked no, who he is, who Christ is, he proclaimed, and quite rightly, he proclaimed by saying, You are the Son of the living God. In acknowledge, Ikaw nga ang Diyos, hindi ako. How often, di ba? How often do we feel like tayo dapat ang masusunod? We should be better. We should be higher. We should be richer. We should be the more intelligent. We should be treated with more respect. Tayo ang hari. Tayo ang Diyos. In whatever little way. Whatever little way. Hindi naman kinakailangan talagang, you know, talagang sobrang pag-akno, pag-angkin uh, ng power. But in our own different little ways, many times, you know, we claim for ourselves, ako dapat ang una. Ako dapat ang, ang bida. Ako dapat ang hari. Ako dapat ang, sa akin dapat ang nagsisilbi, you know? Ako dapat ang masusunod. Ako ang tama. Ako ang mas magaling. We want to be God. We are deceived. We deceive ourselves believing that we want, that we are God, that we are like God, wanting others to treat us like God. But that is not our journey. Our journey is, should end 
we begin with, or we pass through the, the, the stage of humility, of failure, of sin, but our journey is to holiness, to share heaven, to live in heaven um, with God. God came to earth so that he can bring us back to heaven where we belong. Let us pray to St. Peter and St. Paul. Sana tulungan tayo. Ma-realize every time we try to be like God, to realize that we are just God's children. We're just human beings. We may, we may be like God in, in doing godly things, but we are still God's creatures. We are not God. But then our journey continues to heaven, to be with God, to be part of God. Let us all stand now. And we profess our faith. I believe in God, the Father, Father Almighty, Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, on the, On the third day, he rose again, again from, the, from dead. the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the God, the Father Almighty. From there, he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. We bring our intentions to the Father with that same faith of the Apostles, Peter and Paul, with the faith of the fishermen on whom the church is built, and the faith of the teacher of so many nations. After each petition we say, Lord be our rock. Lord be our rock. That Pope Francis, successor of Saint Peter, may bear the keys of the kingdom with wisdom and love. We pray. Lord, be our rock. That missionaries in foreign lands may have the zeal of St. Paul had in bringing the good news. We pray. Lord, be our rock. That we may love our faith and eagerly share it with others. We pray. Lord, be our rock that those who are suffering on account of their faith may find strength in the blood shed by the apostles. We pray. Lord, be our rock. For our brothers and ministry at Bahay Dominico in Quezon City and St. Mary Magdalene in Calarwega. We pray. Lord, be our rock. For the intentions of these Mass, the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, and for our personal intentions. We pray. Lord, be our rock. That the faithful departed, especially Brother Bonifacio Mergal Opi, may be made worthy of the crown of righteousness. We pray. Lord, be our rock. For our personal intentions and for the special intentions of this Mass, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Yeah. Almighty God and Father, hear the prayers of this community gathered in the faith of the Apostles and helped by their intercession. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated.
Bless thy Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth, and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Bless thy Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. May the prayers of the apostles, O Lord, accompany the sacrificial gift that we present to your name for consecration, and may their intercession make us devoted to you in celebration of the sacrifice through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For by your providence, the blessed apostles, Peter and Paul, bring us joy. Peter, foremost in confessing the faith, Paul, its outstanding preacher, Peter, who established the early church from the remnant of Israel, Paul, master and teacher of the Gentiles that you call. And so each in every, in a different way, gathered together the one family of Christ and revered together throughout the world, they share one martyr's crown. And therefore, with all the angels and saints, we praise you as without end we acclaim. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord, Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and, giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. <clears throat> In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. <clears throat> now 
the mystery of faith. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, and Socrates, our bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with St. Peter and Paul, with the blessed apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Please all stand. Let us pray now to our Father in heaven in the words that our Lord himself has taught us. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who we'll live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace.
Lamb of God, you take, take away, away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Please kneel. This is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to this banquet. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Please all stand. Simon Peter said, Lord, to whom shall we go? You have the words of eternal life, and we believe and we are convinced that you are the Christ, the Son of God. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Simon Peter said, Lord, to whom shall we go? You have the words of eternal life. And we believe and we are convinced that you are the Christ, the Son of God. Alleluia. Let us pray. Grant us, O Lord, who have been renewed by this sacrament, so to live in the church, that persevering in the breaking of the bread and in the teaching of the apostles, we may be one heart and one soul, made steadfast in your love, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat sa pakikisa sa Santa Misa. 
The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you all, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go forth, the Mass is ended. Thanks, Thanks be to God. We shall now pray for the sick and bless your religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary. May all these articles be blessed and those who use them made holy as they fulfill the will of God according to the example of the Blessed Mother. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.